What's going on everyone and welcome or welcome back to the channel. It's Ian K. where today I've returned to Carl's Jr. to check out the other new item off of their all new Gold Digger menu. That's right and you already know so stay tuned because the Gold Digger Double Cheeseburger is up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. All right, it's round two of the Gold Digger action over here at Carl's Jr., guys, with their all-new Gold Digger Double Cheeseburger. And guys, what we've got here is some value-sized goodness, and I gotta say that kinda goes against the Gold Digger theme with this one, but we've got a really nice little value cheeseburger over here, a double, with some pretty nice-looking features. Let's break this one down real quick. All right, so it's value-sized flavor lit by fire over here at Carl's Jr., and starting off with a very nice semi-toasted regular-style bun on this one, guys. Let's pop it and take a look underneath. What we've got here is a very decent amount of that Carolina Gold barbecue sauce action, and of course, as we pan down, you're gonna see it's on top of two crispy pieces of bacon, essentially one strip split in half, and there's plenty of that sauce to go with. And guys, that's sitting on two 100% beef patties on top of it. Not bad in the presentation department, I gotta say, and they're split very nicely with that slice of American cheese right there as well. Underneath it, we've got the usual finishing items, lettuce, tomato, pickles, and mayo. But guys, it's all coming back to what this one is supposed to be. And essentially that Gold Digger theme is really kind of playing with my head just a bit, considering this is a value burger. But even still, it's looking pretty awesome. All right, so there you go. It's the all-new Gold Digger Double Cheeseburger here at Carl's Jr. Let's peep out this flavor. So yeah, I'm not saying she's a gold digger, and while Carl's Jr. is definitely doing that, I don't think she would actually go with this particular one personally because it's kind of on the small side still. But guys, it still looks pretty awesome, and I gotta say the presentation is pretty nice. I'm getting some real nice aroma from that Carolina Gold barbecue sauce, and still, like I said, the presentation, not too bad on this one. So let's confirm the goodness. It's the all-new Gold Digger Double Cheeseburger here at Carl's Jr. Let's do it. Mmm. That goes good with the beef. Wow. Yeah, she take my money. Well, Carl's Jr. did, guys. This is actually pretty tasty in the flavor department, so I'm not really minding that one bit. The flavor of the patties goes beautifully with that Carolina Gold barbecue sauce action. It's like a smoky honey mustard, but with that barbecue flair, and it goes amazing with the beef, as you'd expect. Of course, all the crunch with all the goodness on the bottom, the pickles especially, a highlight. And I gotta say, it's really drowning out that tomato action. I'm not minding that one bit, along with the smokiness of the bacon to go with. Not bad on this one. But again, Gold Digger, it's really playing with my head. Why is this called a Gold Digger Burger? I mean, naturally the Carolina Gold Barbecue Sauce, it is what it is. Carl's Jr., please, if you're watching this right now, drop a comment down below, educate the masses as well as myself. I'd love to know why you're calling this a Gold Digger at the same time. But still, it's classic Carl's Jr. flavor on top of it, guys, with really, really beautiful smoky flavor coming from that honey mustard-like Carolina Gold Barbecue Sauce. And I gotta say, the presentation, again, very inviting. Let's go for another couple on this one. Pretty tasty. Mmm, that pickle is amazing with the sauce. That's nice. Well, whoever made my burger, God bless you, because you really loaded up the pickles beautifully on the bottom right there. That is a beautiful situation, and that's really adding to the overall experience with this one. But as you can see, the value size goodness from what I'm getting here does deliver a very solid flavor profile across the board, as you'd expect it to with this Carolina Gold barbecue sauce and the smokiness of that bacon. Again, very nice on display for you here right now, and those pickles are really adding overall again. Very nice combo on this. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised this is actually not on one of their flagship Angus burgers over here, guys, because I can really see the thickness of that meat going beautifully across the board. But I guess they wanted to give a value menu item a little bit of a bump, so to speak, because of the quality of the sauce. If you guys haven't checked out the ham breaded chicken sandwich that I just did, take a look at that review popping up on your screen right now. That was a beautiful combination of freshly made hand breaded goodness on top of the barbecue sauce that came with this, guys. And I gotta say, that was really, really fun to do. Definitely check that one out. But guys, when it comes to this, again, I'm really wishing this was just a bigger burger with more thicker meat, because like I said, that quality of the sauce goes amazing with the beef. And of course, with all the crunchiness on the bottom of this one as well, it's adding beautifully. Those pickles are really, really nice on this one. So let's go for one more bite on this one. We'll wrap the review up with the rating coming up next. But guys, a very solid value here in Southern Cali. It's about $3.49 for this. I believe the average around the country is about $2.99. 50 cents over, not too bad, but again, the quality is what's singing on this one. One more bite and we'll close it out, hang on. Well, the vibrancy of that Carolina Gold barbecue sauce is definitely drowning out the flavor of the cheese that's holding these two patties together, but that's quite all right because I'm still getting that creamy mouthfeel with this one on top of all the other flavors. So like I said, a really awesome flavor profile with this, and I gotta say, it really works very, very nicely. Even if it's slightly above the value price point, it does deliver some pretty awesome flavor. Pretty nice on this. 
All right, so with that said, I'm gonna to have to give the in name only, as far as I'm concerned, Gold Digger Double Cheeseburger here at Carl's Jr. a pretty solid eight out of 10. Guys, like I said all throughout this review, the flavor combination of that Carolina Gold barbecue sauce along with the charbroiled beef over here at Carl's Jr. is a major highlight on this one. It really goes very nicely. Add in the smokiness of the bacon and of course all the other crunchy goodies on that one, especially the pickles, and you've got a pretty decent value for what you've got over here. A little over $2.99 here in Southern Cali, $3.49. It's still a pretty decent value, but nowhere near the gold digger name as far as I'm concerned. But even still, something worth checking out. And obviously, I would love to see that sauce on a much thicker piece of meat over here. But even still, what I've got today was still pretty flavorful. All right, so if you've got Carl's Jr. in the area, do me a quick favor. Drop some comments down below. Would you pay $2.99 or even $3.49 for something like this today? I mean, did this actually look like it was worth it to you? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Eye Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Very nicely done on this one, Carl's Jr. Very nicely done. But do me a favor, please, as you heard me mention in this review, light up one of your flagship Angus burgers with this Carolina Gold barbecue sauce. Then I think we're really gonna have something special. All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.